you might have probably had a DJ taking off a vocal or playing vocals or instrumentals only in the middle of the mix. Well, that's the work of stems. And in this tutorial, we shall be looking at how to separate instrumentals and vocals of any track or song on Virtual DJ. So we shall be setting two keys or buttons on the keyboard that will help us to achieve it. First, we shall set a key which we shall be using to only play the vocal. And then secondly, we shall be setting a key which will help us to play only the instrumental of the song. So without wasting much time, let's get started. So to set it, go to settings and then head over to controllers and then go to advanced editor. So the two keys I use are close to each other, which helps me to trigger them so easily. So for the first one, which is for vocal, we shall be using this key here on the keyboard. And in the action box, I will type in only underscore stem space vocal. This one here will help us to only play the vocal of the track or the song. And then the second mapping is this one. I'll first choose the key. And then in the action box, I will type in mute underscore stem space vocal. This one will mute the vocal of the track, which at the end will leave the instrumental only to play. So those are the two mappings that we shall be using to carry out the extraction or separation of the stems and the vocals. So save these mappings and then close this window. So we have set the mappings on this key and this other key. So this is how the two mappings work. Play the song or the track and then press on the key you have set to only play the vocal. So this is how you should do it. So there's a quick reminder here, stem separation works best on laptops that are having graphics cards. Mostly DJs who use controllers have computers that are having a graphics card, but the one I'm having here doesn't have a graphics card. That's why you can hear some a little bit of vocal even though you want to play the instrumental only. Or you can hear some instrumental when you want to hear the or play the vocal only. So that is the reason why you can hear those stems or instrumentals whenever you want to trigger a different thing. But you can manipulate and change some settings here so that you can achieve a little bit more better instrumentals or vocals from any track. So to change the settings, let's go back to settings. And then let's head over to option and then in the search box here type in stem and then the first mapping here is for automation make sure you've changed this one from pads to all so that whenever you load a new song the stems will be resetted to its original points and the next settings here are for the controls so normally when you install virtual dj these are the default settings here. So I like changing these stems bleed mute vocal to 50%. And then the stems bleed mute instrumental, I'll leave it to 30%. And then the next stems bleed only vocal, I'll put it to either 70 or 60. And then the stem bleed instrumental only, I'll put it to 100. So those are the values I use here 
and then after finishing everything close and then you can now play your music and you will notice a big difference between the first test we have had and the test that you will be having at last so we have very many tutorials here on our channel which can help you to build up or to gain experience from being a beginner to amateur and then to professional so go and watch or check out this channel so that you'll be guided step by step and then i'll be seeing you right in the tutorials